Redcon 1 Grunt Tribute. Hey, what's up guys, it's Josh here. Today I wanna to do a little review on this Redcon 1 Grunt. Now, this is a little bit of a bare bones formula. I think Redcon 1 has a mix called Moab, which is a little bit more complex. It's a little bit more expensive. It's a little more exotic. This is an essential amino acid formula, which basically means that it contains little bits of every single amino acid that is necessary. Like certain amino acids we create naturally, certain ones we need to get through food. This one contains all the ones that you need to get through food. If you know Redcon 1, Redcon 1 is generally like a bodybuilding style brand. This is mainly like a BCAA mix with a few extra essential amino acids in there. I was looking at some reviews online and they were pretty much talking badly about certain ones of these amino acids. They have 25 milligrams or 50 milligrams. The thing of it is, this is like a muscle building formula. The things that build muscle are the BCAAs. The BCAAs are high in this and then the other ones are kind of lower. So the reason that they did that, when you take just BCAAs, it's a little bit unbalanced because your body's not used to getting just BCAAs. It's used to getting a full spectrum of protein. By putting a little bits of the other ones in there, it tells your body that yes, you are getting those BCAAs and they are gonna do work, but it is more of a natural blend because it contains a little bit of everything. I've also looked up that when you take like the full spectrum of protein, along with BCAAs, it's a lot more effective. So that's essentially it, guys. This is a very, very bare bones formula. They got six grams BCAAs per scoop and then 30 scoops. I've seen some brands as low as four grams of BCAAs. I would say about five grams is usually about the right down the middle. So six grams BCA is really good. Essentially, this is more of a BCAA blend. If you're somebody taking this for essential amino acids, like I said, a lot of these amino acids are lower. Tryptophan's in here, 50 milligrams. Tryptophan makes you super tired. So so I really wouldn't want more than 50 milligrams. I like tryptophan at night personally. On the flavor, I got tiger's blood. It does taste a little bit unique. The flavoring on this is actually really sweet and really strong. So if you're somebody who likes that, it's very sweet and very strong. If you're somebody who does not like extra sweets, it's very sweet. Even like you go to a half scoop of this stuff, it's super, super sweet. But it does taste very good. It does taste unique. I really do like it. Let me know if you tried Redcon 1 before. Let me know if you tried any of the other products. Again, this is mainly a BCAA product. Products. So if you're somebody who like got diagnosed with low essential amino acids, I might go with another mix. But this brand, like I said, is a bodybuilding brand. So it makes sense that they're maxing out the BCAAs and giving you just a little bit of everything else. So it's a more well-balanced blend on your body. A lot more of the other stuff Redcon 1 has is more exotic. Like I said, the Moab is very exotic. A lot of their fat burners and pre-workouts are very exotic. And the main reason I got this one personally is because it has no artificial colors. I've said it on my channel a lot, but I haven't had artificial artificial colors in months. I only buy things that don't contain them. So pretty much all the Redcon 1 line contains no artificial colors. So I am super, super down. Let me know what you think of Redcon 1. Let me know what you think of BCAAs. Let me know what your favorite BCAA blend is. I guess this is technically a BCAA blend in my opinion with just some extra amino acids in there. When I have BCAAs, I do like a little bit of carnitine and I do like a little bit of glutamine. That's just me personally. But this is a very, very solid blend. And if it had glutamine and it had carnitine, it technically wouldn't be an essential amino acid blend. So I'm not putting Putting Redcon 1 down at all for that. But anyways, guys, let me know what you think of Grunt. Let me know what you think of Redcon 1. And let me know what supplements I should be reviewing next. I'm always trying new supplements as much as I can. And again, I only buy things that have no artificial colors in it. So please suggest me those if you know any. To run the road 25,000 subscribers and I couldn't do that. Any of you guys help. You guys are the best. I'm having a great day out here. Hopefully I'm having a great day at home. See you all in the next video. Peace.